Hello everyone, it's me Bibi. Today we are making some couscous with beef skewers. It's about three pounds and the sizes are small to mediums. To season the meat, you're gonna need some garlic, dry chili pepper, salt, jumbo cubes, and we're going to need some fresh black pepper. This seasoning might look small, but later on we're gonna season it at least two different times so the meat can get tasty and more flavorful. And this is about two tablespoons of Dijon mustard. The vegetable oil is going to help the seasoning spread all over the meat. This is margarine spread and if you don't have margarine, you can use any kind of cooking oil. The meat was resting for a good two hours before it was cooked, so the flavor can penetrate even better. We try to steam the meat so it's gonna be more tender by the time we grill it. And this is the reason why we're adding some splashes of water and we're gonna cover it and cook it at a medium low for about 30 to 40 minutes. This is 40 minutes into the cooking and the meat is about 80% tender. It's not quite there yet, but it's almost. So what you wanna do is remove it from the heat and put it away till it gets cool and you can start doing the skewers. Here we have some yellow peppers, red peppers, green peppers and onions and they are beautiful vegetables and we're going to need some metal skewers or if you have wood skewers too that's good it does not have to be like a perfect order since the meat is going to be like the star of the dish you want to try to put more beef on the skewers than vegetables And if it looks like or close to look like this, I think it's fine. And this is what they look like. You're gonna need some kind of marinated sauce also to put on the skewers while it's grilling. That's why here you have some garlic, pepper, salt, jumbo cubes, onion, and some dry red pepper. After you mix all the spices in, you're going to add some oil. What the oil is going to do is to make the marinade more spreadable onto the skewers. And you're going to add some few spoonful of Dijon mustard. And it's going to bring more flavors into the marinade too. We have some charcoal here and we're going to lay our grill over. And we're going to cover it with some little bit of oil to keep the meat from not sticking on the grill. Then place the skewers. And remember the meat was fully cooked and almost tender. So you're not going to grill this long. Maybe like 2-3 to three minutes on each side just to get some little bit of color and some grilling flavor. And it was a very good idea to steam the meat first before grilling it. If you did not steam the meat and just grill it first, it would have taken the meat so long to cook all the way through and become tender. Now it's time to make the couscous. Couscous are like small balls of semolina wheat. And its origin are from Morocco. Couscous are the easiest thing to make. If you can fry an egg, you can make couscous. What you have here is some yellow food coloring powder and salt. You're going to add some water, mix it well, then add it into the couscous. This is about two pounds of couscous. Once you add all the hot water, the couscous is going to start expanding and doubling in size and it's going to absorb every single bit of the hot water. You can put the couscous aside while covering it with a towel for about five minutes. At this point, the couscous is tender and ready to eat. 
For more colors on the couscous, you can add some vegetable mix. Time to make the sauce that will go over the couscous and the skewers. Here we have some diced onions. I just added some jumbo. And before I added the onion in, there was some hot vegetable oil. And add some few spoonful of Dijon mustard. Once you add the water in, you can turn down the heat and the onion gonna be turning into this nice caramelized color and that's when you know it's ready. And the only thing that's missing from this sauce is supposed to have some black pepper and I went out of it. And this was requested by one of my subscribers, her name is Tia Tati. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you back here for another new video. Bye.